Let's meet Harsha, one of our top 20 finalists of Witblock's Young Inventor TechFest 2020. Hi, my name is Harsha. I am studying in 10th standard in the Salon School and I am from Bengaluru. My hobbies are astronomy, solving Rubik's Cube and programming. Hi guys, my name is Sasha and my project for IIT Bombay is a smart earth box which can sense gas leak or if the door is open fully in case of you are not in house instead of connecting to Wi-Fi or Bluetooth it connects to web which means it can transmit notification to you if you are in any part of the world and it has both commercial and industrial use also because it can sense LPG which is one of the most flammable substance in every house and uh, those gases like hydrogen carbon monoxide carbon monoxide is one of the major compound found in smoke so it can literally sense fire it also have an industrial use because it can be used in industries by just changing the MQ sensor which is over here according to their requirement what it should sense and there are many type of VMQ sensors which could sense different kind of gases. Many of you may know the Wise gas leak incidents. Over 20 citizens were being killed and many of them have a long term side effect. My project. Save many of their lives. By just one notification would be enough to save their life. And if installed in every house it could save thousands and thousands of life. You may ask have you tested it in a long range distance? And I can say yes because my friend was Vishal, he has went to Rajasthan and we were successful in transferring data from here to there. From here from Bengaluru to Rajasthan it is about 2085 kilometers and its manufacturing price will not exceed about 1000 rupees. And if you sell for commercial rate also including all the taxes and everything the manufacture rate of this will be below 2000 so let's talk about how it works and its app and its programming so first command will be define blink print serial it is used to define the commands which will use for printing on serial monitor and the next command will be include ESP8266.h which is an library used with ESP8266 which our node MC have on it. Command will be include link simple ESP8266.h which is used to communicate with our hardware and our software which is our blink app. You can think this is a variable to store the value of the color which is in X form. Even this is the same thing but it stores the blue and the other one stores the red value. We are doing it an integer to store the pin value for our convenience as yes. Okay. One goes for the door. You can call this as an ID because it is where the data is transmitted to the server and where it is stored. The general code used to define our local Wi-Fi network name and password. Why set up your written pin mode? 
gas input. We have written gas because we have already given the one variable as gas for our convenience. And input because it is a sensor and we want to get data from it. The same goes for the door also. Serial begin 9600 is the bound rate at which our computer and the node MCU transfer data with each other at the development stage. This time we are going to connect our node MCU to the blink app. After connecting, we will show blink connected on the serial monitor of the computer using this command. This is where our main logic comes to place. If our gas sensor sends gas, then it will drop to low because most of the gas sensors use high command but we are going to use low because this is how my gas sensor work and if it is low then it will start to send notification to the blink cap saying fire or gas leak found. Say, now we are going I... to turn on the LED and set this color to red. We are using virtual right because it is not directly connected to the node MCU. Even if the gas or fire is not found, we are going to turn on the LED but we are going to set this color to green using virtual right. If the distance sensor does not sense the one near the door or if it goes low, the same thing goes for the door also but instead of notifying the fire or gas leak from you are going to notify the door open as you can see there are two LEDs on my screen one for the gas sensor and the other for the door sensor which becomes red when it's activated and you can see that I am not directly connected to the log MCU uh, Wi-Fi or hotspot. For demonstration purpose, here I have an indecent stick and a petroleum lighter. First, we will go with the indecent stick uh, to generate smoke. And whenever the sensor detects the smoke, it will send a notification to your mobile. And it keeps sending notification one per five seconds. And it will keep on sending a notification until it stops detecting the smoke so you can't just ignore the notification because it will be rapidly coming so let me try with an petroleum lighter don't try this at home and now i have a petroleum lighter with me i will light it up and off the fire and keep it near the yum to sensor and within a few seconds you will see a notification on the mobile saying that gas leak or fire found it will keep on coming as i told you before and if you notice the color of the LED will change from green to red so let me show you the demonstration of the door alert system whenever i try to open the door you will see an instant notification on my mobile that the door has been open or door open and even the color of the LED will change from green to red and it will be helpful if you are not in house and if someone tries to break your house you will get an instant notification thank you here i have an indecent stick and my blink cap is open as you can see i have added an LED panel to the blink cap and a new feature is going to come which is an animated display feature so that anyone can understand what is going on and as you can see I, when i keep the indecent stick near the my project the LED turns red and you start getting notification and even the LCD panel will show you the fire alert and the notification will keep on coming until the indecent stick is removed or still the fire is off so that you just can't clear it off and after removing the indecent stick the LED turns green and even the LCD will display will change. Now I will sh now I will show you the door open alert. As you can see, the door status is green, which means the door is closed, and even the LED panel showing your house is safe. Now, as soon as I open the door, you will get a pop-up notification on your screen that door opened, and even the LCD display will change, and the color of the LED will turn red. And it everything's turned back when the door is closed. 
over to you sir, judges I want to tell you a thing that it was just a beta version and i have added a new feature that um it can literally send the email to the nearby farm nearby emergency service for even for the fire alert including your address which will which you will give while registering and i have added the new animated display so that even illiterate can understand what is going on so can i share my screen to show that okay uh suman are you giving him uh, the yeah please be quick yeah okay sir So just a second, I will um just. And I I have even added the Wi-Fi con um, configuration features. Sir, shall I show that also, sir? No, I think uh, we I'm can skip sure those parts. I'm very sure if we have enough time. I don't yeah, think we have enough exactly. time for it. Uh, so what is important is that we understand your part and is you can extend it. Uh, so uh, yeah, the demonstration would be good. But at the same time, uh, without demonstration, also we can uh, we can imagine what is going to happen. Like you know, it's not uh, very difficult for us to uh, understand what extension that you're trying to do. So well done, Arsha. Uh, that's very good. Thank and, you, sir. Uh, and it's a good combination again with the software and the hardware. Uh, yeah, I think Rishab, uh, if you have some questions, you can ask him. Yeah? Sir, I have even added a private server to the Blink app so that um, the data transfer will be at a high speed. Okay, that's that's that, that that's great. Okay, that that's fine. I think we we understand your project and. So Harsha, the primary uh, purpose of your product is to uh, is to avoid gas uh, leakage, or is it to be a door opener and have gas leakage as an add-on? So it is basically a gas leak center sensor, which an um, door open alert as an add-on. Okay, so it just uh, detects if the door is uh, being opened, or does it also uh, is the door opener? It will only detect the door open or closed. But uh, how is it relevant uh, in this scenario? Uh, like, can you give me a use case where uh, this door opening uh, alert? is useful uh if you are not in house and uh, if you have went uh, to your village or somewhere so at the time um, the oh, yeah so it's not a... related to uh, any uh, scenario where gas is being leaked yeah yes sir and um, it can be in because um, you can sense uh, the gas smell sir if you are in house and if you are not in house then also you can come to know that the gas has been leaked this um, yeah and in the video you mentioned that uh, it does not use as wifi or bluetooth so you can uh, uh, get the day, uh, get the notification anywhere so what does it use for connectivity how does it connect to the internet actually it is an iot based it connects to the local hotspots i mean um, oh yeah so the nearby... then wifi yes sir okay got it got it but it does not directly connect uh, to the um, device it can uh, this is an iot based uh but the connectivity type is wifi right yes sir w- what do you u- what are you using as the microcontroller is it esp yes sir esp8266 okay got it so hasha that was a nice presentation i seem to have missed the lpg detector uh, demo uh, are there other lpg detectors in the market yes sir but none of them are commercial and um, they are very expensive which are about 10000 rupees so 
but do you think it's uh, they're uh, expensive uh, because they're using industrial grade sensors is it because of that or are they the exactly the same thing but more expensive actually they are industrial grades and um, they can sense a lot of um, other gases which are not useful for commercial use okay uh so do you plan uh, uh do you plan on uh, further bringing the cost down what's the current cost of this prototype the current cost of the prototype is uh, somewhere between 800 to 8000 rupees 8000 800 to 1000 okay okay got it. many many congratulations to harsha for his invention on behalf of the entire team of with blocks and tech fest We wish him the very best of luck for the future.